Thank you. They are running for governor. Republican Matt Bevin and Democrat Jack Conway spent the day making last-minute campaign stops in Lexington. Now, Bevin held a rally at Bluegrass Airport today. Conway was at Wild Eggs in Palomar with other candidates on the Democratic ticket. Both of the men have different ideas as to how Kentucky should tackle some big issues like health care and education. Our Rebecca Smith has a look at the similarities and differences between the two candidates in what is seen as a tight race. So maybe you are just right now getting down to thinking about Election Day, which is tomorrow, and voting. Never fear, we've got you covered on all the major issues and where the two candidates for governor stand on them. Perhaps the defining issue for both candidates is health care. Democrat Jack Conway favors the status quo, keeping connect. Republican Matt Bevin says he would dismantle the state's exchange because Kentucky is already paying for the federal exchange. Starting in 2016, those folks who are enrolled through the connect exchange will, during that re-enrollment process, re-enroll on the federal exchange where they can get the very same thing. Well, I do support keeping Connect. I think it's been a national model. It's paying for itself by a, a 1% 1 uh, 1 fee that's on the insurers that was already in place. We're doing it efficiently. There are major differences in where the candidates stand on education. Matt Bevan is more open to uh, charter schools and, and going forward with some options that have not been previously tried. I think that Conway is a, a protector of public education as is, with the exception he wants to add more emphasis on early childhood education. One area the candidates can agree on, coal. Both want more jobs. Both uh, say that uh, coal is important. Uh, each candidate indicates uh, that they would bring uh, some prosperity to Kentucky in different ways. Whether they agree or disagree, our political expert Bill Bryant says this election could be a litmus test for the rest of the country. I think that you will see people take a cue from what happens Tuesday night in Kentucky and attempt to at least say that this may apply across the country, whatever kind of decision that uh, Kentucky makes. For all things election, just hop on over to our website, WKYT.com. You should be able to click on the election tab for that. In Lexington, Rebecca Smith, WKYT News. Third, third party candidate for Governor Drew Curtis says he would like an audit of Connect and is against an outright repeal. He supports the idea of early college high schools across the state and, like the other two candidates, says he supports coal.